surprise announcement by Pope Benedict XVI that he's stepping down at the end of this month. Remember, his tenure has been marked by several controversies. Take a look. The scrutiny began before he even assumed the papacy. For decades before his elevation, when he was Cardinal John Ratzinger, Pope Benedict XVI had worked as the Vatican's chief investigator into allegations of sex abuse by priests. But critics said as a cardinal, Benedict was part of the system of cover-ups of abuse and the practice of moving priests from parish to parish to avoid trouble. When he was a bishop in Germany, where he uh, knew of accusations against a priest and really didn't act against it. And right here at the Basilica of the National Shrine of the Immaculate Conception, one of the biggest Catholic churches in the Americas, Benedict made an extraordinary request. We too insistently beg forgiveness from God and from the persons involved, uh, while promising to do everything possible to ensure that such abuse will never occur again. A more extensive apology came later that year in Australia where Benedict used the words unequivocal condemnation. There were other controversies. The year after he was elevated, the Pope quoted a Byzantine emperor's words saying the Prophet Muhammad had brought, quote, things only evil and inhuman. That touched off outrage and protest in the Muslim world. Benedict later clarified, saying those weren't his personal views. Last year, the Pope's butler was convicted of stealing and leaking documents, exposing corruption and disorganization at the Vatican. Christ was controversial. The things that Jesus did, the way that he reached out to people, the way he talked to people, the types of people that he talked to, it upset many, many people. 